So the first step to import your FBX from Maya into Houdini is you have to open file, go to import, then FBX, and then deselect all of the items that you don't need. And I just want to import my geometry, animation, and materials. And you're going to hit this icon and then type in where your file is located. and then import your FBX file that you got from Maya of your animation and press import. And it's gonna come in really big. So you're gonna to have to go into your FBX object and then select all of your geometry and also select your materials because that's where your textures are. Press Ctrl X and then go back to your objects panel. And then paste them in there. And I'm just going to organize my geometry and make it closer together. and then move my materials. And you're gonna press tab and then type in null and place a null in your objects and attach the null to all of your geometry. And then in the null, uniformly scale them to 0.1 so they're not as big. And now we'll start fixing our textures. So, in your Objects panel, go to Materials. Inside your Materials are all the textures that got imported with the FBX, and I'm just going to move the ones I don't need aside. And I'm just going to start with my Butterfly Texture. In it, I'm going to hit the Texture tab. Use texture and base color. Hit that button and that's going to allow me to choose the image and I just have to find where my image is located. Select the image, hit accept, and now you've linked that image to your texture. And I'm going to move on to the skull texture. Now I'm going to go back out to the objects node. And one at a time, I'm going to assign my textures back to my geometry. So I'm going to start with the skull. I'm going to go up top and click Render. I'm going to hit that icon. And the materials that were imported are now in my Objects panel. So I'm going to drop that down. Then I'm going to drop down my materials. And I'm going to choose my skull texture. And now I've linked my skull texture to my skull geometry. And I'm just going to do the same thing with my jaw. Now when my textures got imported in and reassigned, they came in darker than I wanted. So to fix that, you just have to go back into your materials and select the material you want to change. And up top, you're going to hit the surface tab. And you're able to change how your textures look in this tab. And that's how you import your materials and reassign them and edit them in Houdini.